final layers of gel for the mold tool to the deck. We will then create the mold tool through vacuum bagging and epoxy. This is to enable us to pre-impregnate the fibre that we're using to construct the mold tools because we're using a heavyweight cloth and enable us to wet it out quicker, get it on the job quicker, which then enables us to do both the inside skin core and the outside skin in one hit and then vacuum bagging which gives us a good good five weight ratio for the mould which basically makes the mould stronger and um, lighter and stiffer. The same gives us benefits when we then produce the mouldings out of the mould in surface finish and shape. You guys are putting in extras onto the mould tool uh, basically so that when we actually come through the big lamp it makes it all a lot easier. We're not trimming and trying to get around all the details but we can then just put down big rolls of glass that have been impregnated on the mangle and, um, and get the core on and get it back down in as short a time as possible. So they're doing the little details here. As you see we've started off in, um, building and working out and building the actual details, the big pots in the front. Three of those going on, all the, all the features, all the flanges. The problem is with blowholes, they're holes, and of course we're infusing the boat, so we have to make sure we can seal them, because all these blowholes actually have a fitting to put in, so we can then link them all together, and they won't leak. We might cut in the core, basically on all the flat surfaces, we'll put in a cork to separate the surfaces of the laminate to give us a stiff panel.